Hello and welcome to the news from Bahrain International. I am Hamad Yusuf. His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa issued Decree Law 20 of 2020, adding a new clause 2 to paragraph C of Article 8, featuring in Law 78 of 2006 on insurance against unemployment. The new paragraph shall read as follows. Payment of a percentage of wages of Bahraini workers insured under the social insurance law under Decree Law 24 of 1976 with a maximum of 50% of the wage insured under it and companies affected by the coronavirus who are registered with the ministry in accordance with the terms and conditions set by the minister and the disbursement as for a period of three months from July 2020 subject to paragraph E of this article. His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa received a letter of thanks and appreciation from His Royal Highness the Crown Prince, Deputy Supreme Commander and First Deputy Premier Prince Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa regarding His Majesty's keynote speech during the Supreme Defence Council meeting. His Royal Highness praised the speech of His Majesty the King and affirmed that ex to exert further efforts to achieve further progress and prosperity for Bahrain and its people. He hailed the efforts of Team Bahrain and the unity of the Bahraini people in combating Corona pandemic. He also praised the directors of His Majesty the King that aimed to ensure the safety and health of the people of Bahrain. His Royal Highness wished His Majesty the King lasting good health and happiness and for the kingdom and its people for their progress and prosperity. The representative of His Majesty the King for Humanitarian Work and Youth Affairs National Security Advisor and Chairman of the Supreme Council for Youth and Sport, His Highness Sheikh Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa, received the outgoing U.S. Ambassador to Bahrain, Justin Sibero. His Highness praised the close relations between Bahrain and the U.S. in various fields, expressing his appreciation of the ambassador's efforts that contributed to strengthening them. The ambassador expressed his gratitude to His Highness Sheikh Nasser for his interest in enhancing the Bahraini-American relations and cooperation in various fields. He praised the cooperation he received during his diplomatic term in the kingdom, wishing Bahrain and its people further progress and prosperity. The Speaker of the Representatives Council, Fawziya Zainal, paid a tribute to His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa for his visions which inspired national efforts to achieve goals and stability. She held His Majesty's keynote speech, which represents a national roadmap to overcome the COVID-19 challenges. She held His Majesty's keenness on citizens and residents' safety and health, stressing the need to translate His Majesty the King's directives regarding individual responsibility and community partnership in order to overcome the pandemic. Zainal commended the role of the government led by His Royal Highness the Prime Minister Prince Khalifa bin Salman Al Khalifa and also hailed the efforts of His Royal Highness the Crown Prince, Deputy Supreme Commander and First Deputy Prime Minister Prince Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa in leading the National Task Force for Combating COVID-19. The Speaker praised the pivotal and patriotic role played by the medical, security, military and administrative teams who stand on the front line in the fight against the pandemic. The chairman of the Shura Council, Ali Saleh, paid tribute to His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa, hailing the keynote speech he had delivered while chairing the Supreme Defense Council. He praised His Majesty's keenness to ensure citizens and residents' safety and health, stressing the importance of individual responsibility and community partnership to overcome these challenges. He commended His Majesty's directors, which supported Bahrain's success in managing the emergency health crisis and maintaining the economic growth momentum. He commended the role of the government led by His Royal Highness the Prime Minister Prince Khalifa bin Salman Al Khalifa and the efforts of His Royal Highness the Crown Prince, Deputy Supreme Commander and First Deputy Prime Minister Prince Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa in leading the National Task Force for Combating COVID-19. Saleh hailed His Majesty's words of praise and recognition of citizens' efforts in all areas, particularly the military, security, civil and medical teams who stand on the front line in fighting the virus. Under the patronage of His Royal Highness the Prime Minister, Ibn Khaldun National School held its 29th graduation ceremony. Ibn Khaldun National School President Dr. Kamal Abdul Noor addressed the virtual ceremony, paying tribute to His Royal Highness the Premier for patronizing the graduation of the 29th batch of students. The school's Board of Trustees Chairman Farooq Yusuf M. Ayyad extended thanks to His Royal Highness the Premier for his constant support, hailing the directors to develop the educational system. He also congratulated the graduates on their academic achievements, wishing them further success. Bahrain's ambassador to the U.S., Sheikh Abdullah bin Rashid Al Khalifa, also addressed the ceremony on behalf of the graduates. He hailed Bahrain's landmark educational strides in the prosperous era of His Majesty the King, paying tribute to His Royal Highness the Premier for patronizing the ceremony. After that, the certificates were distributed to the graduates.
قد بفضل ما تنعم به مملكة البحرين من ريادة وتطور في العهد الزاهر لسيدي حضرة صاحب الجلالة الملك حمد بن عيسى آل خليفة حفظه المولى وأيده بنصره تسارعت وتيرة التنمية وحرصت المؤسسات التعليمية على مواصلة عملها النبيل لتجني ثمارها اليوم ورغم تفشي الجائحة عالميا واصلتم العمل والاجتهاد ولم تتراجعوا وانما تكيفتم مع الامر واتبعتم طرق تعليميه جديده وابديتم اصراركم للوصول الى هدفكم وها انتم على مشارف الانتقال الى مرحله هامه في حياتكم فلا تشعروا بالقلق رغم اننا نتحدث عن وباء مس دول العالم اجمع إلا أنه بالنظر إلى الواقع الأقل ضبابية فأنتم في حقيقة الأمر مقبلين على مرحلة واعدة في تاريخ البحرين لتنضموا إلى فريق لي عظيم الشرف أن أحسب نفسي عضوا فيه ألا وهو فريق البحرين